knowing the hats and the protector deities of any tradition is uh, the easiest way to uh, identify uh, paintings as to what tradition it follows. And the, the hats, you need to know the color and the shape. And then for the protectors, you, you have to learn uh, who the main deities are, protector deities of, of each particular tradition. And sometimes you only have to learn one figure from each tradition to then be able to identify uh, what uh, school of Buddhism or the Bun religion a painting belongs to. So for the Sakya tradition, we have really uh, three figures that are most important. And the first is a Panjanata Mahakala. Panjanata Mahakala, uh, the Panjanata means uh, um, Lord of the Pavilion. Uh, Panjara is a pavilion, and the pavilion here is he's the Lord of a pavilion made of Vajra. So it's like a it's like a fortress or a, a castle or a citadel, entirely made of large and small Vajras. And and Mahakala uh, resides within this uh, Vajra um, canopy. This Vajra enclosure. Now, Mahakala has one face, two arms, uh, a very squat body, and often with uh, bent uh, legs from the weight of the torso. He holds a Vajra, uh, a Vajra handled uh, 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 flaying knife, curved knife, and, uh, and a skull cup in the two hands held at the heart. And often there's a, a, a staff, a, a Gandhi staff, uh, which is carried across the forearms. This actually comes out of foundational Buddhism, and it is a large wooden plank that is, uh, uh, which is struck to call the monks to, uh, to uh, uh, services. Um, still used to this day. So, uh, Panjanata Mahakala, one face, two arms, a very squat body. Now, along with this, we have what's called uh, uh, Brahmana Rupa Mahakala. Now, now this is really a Tibetan made-up appearance to, to uh, uh, in place of the four-faced, four-armed Mahakala. So, the Brahmana Rupa form appears as a kind of a Mahasiddha figure. It appears as a, an Indian Rishi, um, a, a, a older man, skinny, long white hair piled on top of his head, uh, a white beard, just, just two arms, two legs, holding various uh, attributes in his hands. Uh, and uh, this will be will be placed at one side of the uh, Mahakala of the one face two armed Panjanata Mahakala, and then on the other side we'll have a form of Sri Devi Dudsoma, and this this form of Sri Devi um, different from the the typical Geluk form. This form has one face and four arms and rides a donkey, and has various attributes in the four hands. So this is very common uh, to find in the in in earlier paintings in the bottom register of of paintings and it, and again it can be at the right side left side or in the middle with floating figure paintings then it will be found in the lower uh, portion of the composition so it is these three figures which will which will characterize uh, a Sakya painting Panjanata Mahakala. Brahmana Rupa Mahakala, and then the four-armed Sri Devi. Uh, usually, they're 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 also placed very close together in the composition. So that's Sakya protectors.